to help you out with Black Friday, and I know that I am one of the few channels that deals with hair loss, thinning hair, and some of our unique requirements that maybe some other seborrhea, dermatitis, alopecia. So we have a few things that we need to know about for Black Friday that other people might not. So I'm going to now talk about dandruff shampoos. I think that everyone who's dealing with any kind of dermatitis should, alopecia, any sort of thing like that, should definitely use dandruff shampoos. I think that they clean your hair a little better, more intensely, and furthermore, Additionally, I think that they have something in them that fights against any kind of bacteria, fungus type things that may be on the scalp that might be preventing follicles from being strong and healthy. So I'm going to do some, review some of them for you and tell you what I think of them. I'm going to start with the extensive ones and then I'm going to go on to the cheaper ones. This Kerastase, it's Bang Gomage. Intervention anti what it, oh Lord, help me Jesus. Whoo Lord. Ah this is dandruff shampoo. That's what this is. Gentle anti dandruff shampoo. So if you go online and you <laughs> look at the bottle, this is the one for dry hair. And I love this dandruff shampoo. It conditions my hair. I can use it twice a week. I sometimes mix this dandruff shampoo with other shampoos just so I get a little bit of that dandruff effect. This dandruff shampoo uses perinthium zinc in it. And the benefit of perinthium zinc is that perinthium zinc strengthens your follicles and increases your angium phase. Angium phase is a phase where your hair is growing. So it will, this encourages your hair to grow for a longer time. Those of us who are dealing with problems of hair fallout, this strengthens your hair as a follicle and I lose. I, I have actually gotten to the point where I've used dandruff shampoo with perinthium zinc. Uh, I'm probably not saying that right, but it's the perinthium zinc one where I don't lose follicles. I, 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 my shedding can go down to zero for several days. It, I, I will get some shedding, but it really is a good product for shedding. Now I'm going to give you a dollar store alternative. Halsa from the dollar store. Perinthium zinc says they're right there, Perinthian Zinc, Dandruff Shampoo, Dry Scalp Care, one dollar, one dollar. This is just as good as the Kerastase. Kerastase is thirty dollars, this is one dollar. You get thirteen ounces, thirteen and a half ounces of this one. You get eight and a half ounces of this one. So it's just a matter, if you need a designer brand, get you some Kerastase. For dry hair, damage shampoo for dry hair, it has to have that perinthian zinc in it. Um, perithi, no, I can't pronounce any of these things, guys, <laughs> but I got the bottle. It has to have that in it, right there. Uh, One dollar. Dry scalp care. One dollar. I use this the same way I use the Kerastase. And I, I, my hair can't tell a difference. Maybe I have an emotional difference, but I don't notice any difference. I do know whenever I use either of these two products, I have less scalp fallout. My hair is not dry. It's not brittle or anything like that. My hair seems strengthened, and I enjoy either one of them. I think if you're having hair fallout and thinning, get you a Perinthian Zinc product and start using it. It, it helps with the hair fall out. Here's another one from the Dollar Store. T Plus Gel. I use this. This has um, coal tar in it. And this is strictly, coal tar is very antifungal, antibiotic. So it will kill dandruff products. I, I have now come to prefer the product in the Perinthian Zinc. But if you don't have the Perinthian Zinc, this 
will work. You can use this every day. This is from Dollar Store. I never even bothered to buy the one. I never even bothered to buy the Neutrogena T gel one, so I can't give you a comparison. I tried this one first. It was a dollar. It works good. Actually, when I swim, I have swam every day. And I have used this as my swimmer shampoo. It removes the minerals and the buildup, and my hair grows. Really good product. Okay, here we go with the French products again. They should have a little button on these where I could push the button and know how to say it. This is Phyto uh, Passant. Or phyto, pa, phyto, oh Lord, this is soothing treatment shampoo. That's what they that's what they have there in English for sensitive and irritated scalp. I really enjoy this product here. This has something in it called peroxide oleate, and obviously, as I've explained to you, I am not pronouncing any of these things for me. Peroctane oleate. And let me tell you about peroctane oleate. Peroctane oleate thickens your individual strands of hair by almost 10%. In a year's time, it will thicken a strand of hair so that that strand of hair will go from whatever thickness it is to 7% thicker each strand of hair. So if you're a fine hair person like me, 10% sounds real good to me. You just use this once or twice a week and it thickens your strands of hair. There are many other products that have the peroctane oleate in them. They are all expensive products. And I haven't tried any of the others. I started with this one and it works well. It is gentle. It does not strip my hair. My hair does not feel stripped with this product. It is conditioning to the hair. It is it's gentle on your scalp. Something about the peroctane oleate is gentle on your scalp. It's also a good product for women who are having fertility and hormonal issues. Lord, I just happen to, to have the whole gamut of things that I have to fight. I have to fight many little war, many little battles in the same war <laughs> all at the same time. So this is a good product if you have any issues, pregnancy, menopause, hormonal imbalance, PMS, and it start and it affects your hair. This is a good one. Dandrine. This is some hardcore dandruff shampoo up in here. Whew. This is just shy just let me see if they have on here what the, what the key ingredient is. It's Kella Canazole. And this has 1% Kella Zone in there. This also has something called shell in it. Let me see if I can find it in here. There's shell oil in here, which is, let me see, ascorbic acid. Ammonium, ammo, it has ammonium laurel sulfate, which is stronger than the sor. This is a very strong sulfate. Ammonium laurel sulfate is very strong sulfate, and I know it has shell oil in here. Let me see if I can. I'm reading here, glycerin in there, but that little bit of glycerin in there, it ain't gonna do you no good. You're not even gonna notice that. I'm telling you that right now. This is some strong stuff here. Lord. Oh, it's got grapefruit seed extract in it. I'm gonna just come back with this one because I think I need to. 